The header is a small strip showing your status and indicating which services you are active or inactive in. It also contains more info under the question mark, the settings wheel, and the call on behalf button. In the queue area, you'll see an important update. Calls now appear in a queue card format that shows all essential details. The queue area is smaller due to the more compact design of the queue card. In the active session area, you will see your active call in a so-called task card. Once the call has been accepted, the task card allows you to set a call on hold, retrieve the call, or terminate the active call. The contact area has been redesigned to provide more space, allowing users to fit more contact cards in a row compared to the previous list of contacts. Despite appearances, this layout actually accommodates more contacts. Users who prefer the list view can easily switch from the contact card view. The contact cards now display the most relevant information and include essential direct actions like save transfer, consultative transfer, and basic call functionality. We have also overhauled the filters for a smoother experience, making it easier to combine different filter types. We have added new filter options for postal code, address, and initials giving you even more precision in finding the right contact. Clicking on a contact card or on the eye symbol in the right panel will open or close the side panel. It gathers all supplementary information in a single location. Here you can find contact details, check the calendar, send a chat or email to the selected contact, or view organizational structure. The side panel acts as your main hub, providing easy access to crucial information and a starting point for further exploration helping you navigate the organization without disrupting your original search.